Please subscribe and click on the notification button so you could get our latest news. Happy listening. Breaking news. Fumi Falani tells Nigerians to defend their human rights. Nigerians have been urged to rise up in defense of their human rights in the interest of peace and justice. The founder, Women Empowerment and Legal Aid, WELA, Mrs. Fumi Falani, who made a call in Lagos, demonstrated and admonished Nigerians to stand up for human rights for everyone, everywhere, and at every time. We must stand up for equality, justice, and human dignity because it is virtual to our lives, each and every one of us, women, men, children alike. Said Falani, who spoke during a walk organized by WELA, to commemorate the International Human Rights Day. The need to end discrimination against women in Nigeria to close the existing gender gap also necessitates the birth of WELA to assist in efforts to stop abuse against women. All gender barriers women and girls in Nigeria experience. In times like this, we all must come together to educate ourselves and our youth in basic human rights. These rights were set forth by the United Nations in the Universal Declaration of Human Rights. The purpose of human rights work is to unite all people in this area and rights and to make them realize and know what they stand for. You need to know your human rights because... A population ignorant of his rights cannot demand or defend them. Yet, few in the world know even two or three of their 30 human rights. I'm very glad Fallon is talking about human rights, um, a political figure. Um, it's good what she's talking about, but let's face facts. Let's call the spade a spade and not call it another name. What are you doing about the rights of bill, the bill that is about to be passed on human rights about people's legality to speak freedom of speech? Yes, that's where I'm going. We make and put together organization just to sap money from the nation. But are we really tackling the issues? One of our fundamental human rights from the United Nations, like you rightly quoted, is freedom of speech, expression, and the government that we have put in place, we should be able to scrutinize them and make constructive criticism. Yet, the same government are passing a bill so that nobody will be able to speak for the government is God. Who says... Nigerians, I call on you today to leave a comment, subscribe, and remember, make the comment respectful and in order so that we can look at what is really going on in our country. Let's give to the people what they duly deserve. Nigeria deserves to be great. And the people deserve all the basic necessity of life. Common politicians do the right thing and stop going around, giving speeches, doing what I say, and never practicing them yourselves. Thank you very much for listening. I hope you have a lovely day.